Hello everyone, what's up? It's Steve from Ukraine. How are you guys doing out there? So today what I have for you guys, a review on this Fear Touch or Object Mouse. Um, this is the titanium version which will run you $175. That is quite a bit of money. They also have two other versions, a $155 and $225 models. So they, they, they run you quite a bit of money so let's take a look and this was sent to me for free for review by the way just want to make sure to let you know that but if you want to see the unboxing click on this box right here and uh, you'll see the unboxing anyways so here's the mouse and uh, it's pretty unique um, I it like I said before it runs you quite a bit of money but uh, here it is very cool design it's something different it's not you know ordinary mouse but um, there was a mouse like this before out before this uh, or object it was called Jelfin. Uh, Jelfin released a circular ball type mouse I think it was a little bit more comfortable than this one and it cost you forty dollars and it's not you know titanium it's not handcrafted and things like that but it was uh, had kind of gel cover on it if you want to see the review just go through my videos and uh, you can see it but uh, that one was a little bit cheaper and that was I think one of the first ones and then uh, I think they started their um, mouses. So it is not Bluetooth, as you can see. There is a cord. The cord is kind of cool, I guess. Um, it's designed kind of to match the mouse, as you can see the USB port. It is pretty cool. It's something different. It says uh, or object on this side. It does have quite a bit of scratches now on it. You probably can't really see that, but uh, there are quite a bit of scratches on it. Um, and uh, right away you will notice the cord is different as well um, it is a uh, nylon mesh cord uh, it's tangle free so it doesn't tangle which is really nice only problem with it is it's so kind of big and kind of weird if you have your laptop there like in front of you it, it, the cord is not very comfortable to work with so that's kind of a negative thing about this cord I don't really like that um, but you know that's kind of a negative thing I guess about this mouse but here it is again there's two buttons it is touch sensitive so you can have touch sensitive and also clicking I prefer the clicking just because it's more comfortable the touch sensitivity is cool and stuff you hold the mouse you touch 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 it does everything but only problem is when you set your fingers down boom you know it activates the left click right click so you have to kinda keep your fingers off that's at least that's how I do it and that's kinda annoying but what's cool about it there is a switch on the bottom and uh, you can switch it to touch or click I prefer click though it's it's a lot easier the touch is cool I'm not gonna deny it but it's just not there um, the comfortability of this mouse is decent I think the uh, gel fin was a little bit more comfortable but uh, you get used to it after a while you do get used to it but it's not a hundred percent comfortable it doesn't fit your hand all the way uh, for example this Apple magic mouse doesn't fit your hand either but um, this one does fit a little bit better that's kinda what I wanted to tell you guys like the MX revolution probably fit your hand better but overall it's more comfortable than the mighty mouse but it's not all the way comfortable the clicking is pretty easy only thing sucks kinda of, that you can't really click on top as you can see it doesn't really click you kinda of have to click right here in the middle or at the bottom so if you wanna relax your fingers like this you can't really click you gotta have it like this so you can actually click So that was kinda of annoying about this mouse the, on the top as you can see that it's uh, laser engraved onto the mouse which is pretty cool and as you can see this part spins as well uh, that is for scrolling since there's no scroll ball here you can hold it like this and scroll it says high speed scrolling but I actually sometimes have to spin it like this to actually scroll with decent speed so that was kind of a problem that I noticed um, but overall it was pretty cool it's, it is kind of annoying sometimes taking your hand off and sitting there scrolling like this and then going back like this like this like this on the bottom what's pretty cool what I like a lot is the ceramic feet um, so you can use it pretty much any surface on any surface on like for example this on a wooden desk or just pretty much anything like that the ceramic feet are really nice the laser is pretty nice you know it's it when I use the mouse it, it responds quick it, everything you know works pretty good I would probably not purchase this mouse I would probably not really recommend it either I'd rather buy a more comfortable mouse than this it is cool if you're into something unique something uh, sophisticated I guess something different uh, this would be your perfect style for you I guess and if you're willing to spend that much money but if you're just a regular user and you, you still like something cool and unique you probably would not spend still $175 on a mouse you can buy a lot you know 
different stuff for $175 or 225 or 155 depends which one you go with also what I noticed as you can see all the fingerprints all this stuff you kind of have to take the microfiber and kind of start kind of pressing really hard to scrub it off and then it becomes all really nice and kind of glossy you can see me in there and everything that's really cool but again once I touch it again all the fingerprints are back on it so it's, it is a big fingerprint magnet it's not Bluetooth either I mean seriously the cable right there it, it kind of gets annoying sometimes even though it's tangle free it is kind of gets in the way um, but if it was Bluetooth it might have been kind of getting close to worth it but still probably not really but that's my review guys let me know what you guys think of this mouse, if you would buy it, if you have any thoughts, you know, just anything, post a comment below, let me know. Thank you guys for watching, hope you guys enjoyed.